I just finished building the magical house from Encanto. This is what I like, and this is what I don't like about this set. I like how colorful the magical house looks from the front. It looks just like the house from the Encanto movie. I don't like how the second floor and middle of the first floor of the interior of the house are all studded. It would have looked much better tiled up so I tiled up my version of the magical house. I like how the magical house is modular because you can take off the third floor and second floor of the house to access the rooms easier. I don't like how skinny the house is. The magical house would have been much more impressive if it was square in dimension instead of a skinny rectangle. However, since the magical house is so thin, it doesn't take up a lot of room, so it's easier for display and storage. I like how they made the roof of the house. It has a Spanish flavor where they use red and dark red half cylinder pieces. I like the pink leaf pieces on the house and the decorations on the leaves look great as well. I don't like all the stickers in this set. It would have been better if the printed designs were on tiles instead. However, I like the designs of all the stickers because they are very colorful and quite detailed. On the main floor, I like the old time record player mini build. And I like the pink umbrella accessory. I also like the family tree sticker design by the eating area. I like how you can easily remove the eating table and the three pink chairs since they were placed on jumper tiles. This makes it easier for better playability. I like the weather play feature where you can switch up the weather from cloudy to a rainbow sky. On the second floor, I like the bright fuchsia sofa mini build. And I like the colorful design on the inside of the door which leads to Maribel's room. Inside Maribel's room, I like the sewing machine mini build which has some nice parts usage. I also like the play feature where a lever on the outside of the house allow you to tilt Maribel's bed to wake her up. And the window shutters by her bed can flip open and close using another lever. On the highest level of the house, I like the vibrant coral and bright green colors. And it includes another great sticker design from the movie. I like the two mini dolls and one micro doll that we get in this set. I like the Mirabelle mini doll who wears a white blouse with a scalloped asymmetric collar. I like the butterfly and flower design on her shirt as well. She also has a nice teal skirt which includes her family name in the design as well as exotic birds and flowers. I also like Mirabelle's hairpiece which looks great from the front side, and back. I like the accordion accessory that Mirabelle comes with. The accordion has two 1x2 printed tiles, which is nice. I like the Abuela mini doll, which has a dark bluish gray hair piece, which is pulled back. She has a great bright fuchsia dress, which is decorated with a yellow butterfly at her waist and pink butterflies at the bottom of the dress. I like the Antonio mini doll because he has a fun, huge curly hair piece. I like how Antonio's outfit is colorful as he is dressed with a bright yellow shirt and an orange vest and bow tie. We also get a cute little animal, which I like. This is Chisky, the capybara who is made in a hamster mold. So what do you like? What do you don't like? Comment below, let me know, and we will see you all in the next video. Bye.